So as you step out to buy a new piece of jewelry this Diwali, I want to show you something rather special, something quite exciting, which you might want to consider this year on Thanteras. Now this is what would have been known in ancient times as a kanchiguna or a jingling girdle. Now this particular one is made in silver, but depending on your financial status, you could have had one in gold set with precious gems or even maybe one in twisted thread with conch shells. Now these girdles were specifically made to be worn on the upper waist, not on the hips, which is why they're a little bit shorter. And for a jingling girdle, you'll notice that it has very few bells on it. And even if I move it around a lot, they're not very loud. So what's so special about this girdle? Well, in ancient times, in all ancient cultures across the world, a woman was not supposed to be on top during sex. This was seen as a position of power, a position of choice. Um, it was also believed that this position required a lot of strength. Hence, it was not the position for women. The Kama Sutra, however, encouraged women to be on top for certain occasions. But the condition was that you had to execute this position by only moving your hips to bring yourself and your partner to orgasm. You didn't move the rest of your body, just your hips. It wasn't easy. Apparently, the really skilled women would wear for this position jingling girdles with lots and lots of gumrus or bells on their upper waist and make sure that none of the bells made a sound. Can you imagine that kind of skill? Now, this particular girdle, which doesn't have so many bells and neither are they very loud, this would have been worn by a much younger woman, someone just starting out in the games of love, someone just starting to learn the skills. And very likely, she would have also hired musicians to play in the background as an added measure. So even if they jingled, you wouldn't have heard the sound. So are you ready for the challenge of the jingling girdle? Now this Diwali, on my personal advice, why don't you get yourself a kanchaguna, a jingling girdle for Dhanteras? It will definitely bring you more pleasure than any other piece of jewelry. It'll give you and your partner something to giggle together about, which is always a good thing. It will definitely spice up your sex life, I promise you. And it'll mean a few less trips to the gym. It's a win-win situation.